My Borg Werner transmission is overdue for a fluid change. Second is to install new hoses sourced from American Diesel. The new hoses have a larger diameter. The engine manual recommends using a Type A Suffix A automatic transmission fluid or Dexron, which is a Ford branded fluid. Uh, I did a little reading up on Dexron. It's no longer made. It actually contained whale oil. I went to Napa and they have a Dexron slash Mercon ATF. It's a Type A uh, closest match that you can get today. The first step is locating the drain plug. According to the manual, it's on the lower right-hand side of the transmission. I've been unable to locate a drain plug, but one of the coolant hoses does terminate to the lower right-hand side. And since I got to change out the hoses anyway, I went ahead and cracked open the lowest hose to drain as much fluid as I could out of the transmission. I'm not sure as to the total capacity, but I would estimate I drained out approximately two quarts. So I'll start with uh, one new quart and see where we end up on the dipstick. Okay, so that's up to the fill line on the dipstick. Next, I'm gonna start up the engine, put it in gear, and shut her down, check the level again.
Nothing. Needs more. Done. So it took uh, just a touch under two quarts. I'm not sure what the full capacity is, but I hope I got the majority of the coolant out. I labeled the new hoses with the install date. The manual recommends changing the ATF every 200 hours. With the newer fluids, I'm not so sure that's still the case. The fluid I drained out was well over 200 hours, and uh, it looked, smelled uh, about the same as the new stuff. The thing I learned today is next time I want to be able to extract the fluid out of the dipstick hole and not have to get down on my knees down in the bilge to drain from below.